My name is Brian. I've spent the last 20 years of my life growing to what now is one of the largest collections of snakes in the world. Along with me, my wife Lori, 30,000 plus snakes, and my always colorful crew, there never seems to be a dull moment. This is where my passion meets my obsession. Welcome to my world. Well, you know, today is really exciting for me personally because, you know, this is the day that we finally have our first babies hatching. You never know what's going to hatch. Each clutch could be different, and you never know when you're going to get that re really hidden jewel. So the last, you know, four months have been really tough financially on us. Expenses are at the absolute highest, and our revenues uh, are terrible. I'm serious, Lori, about doing those crested geckos and leopards. <laughs> you're not funny. Stop. I'm I swear to gosh, I've already talked to John. He's you can talk all you want to. I swear to God, I'm going to kill you. No, I'm dead serious. So I'm am I. Them. We've got that room upstairs. <laughs> no, that's the baby room now. Well, not, Where yeah, are all well, these snakes going to go? You can have that, you know, like three quarters. I just need that back no. wall. Hey, I'm serious. I'm going to no. do the lep just leopard geckles and crested on the back wall. I swear to God, you better stop because you're making me so mad. I'm not I'm not even <laughs> screwing around, Lori. You know they sell. You know it's a good investment. They're Be not right. coming because I'm not signing for them and they can stay outside. No, I don't, you don't care. Place, I'll go down and get person. I'll go down and get them. <laughs> to be honest with you, it kind of, you know, pisses me off. Lori's always constantly bucking me on my things. You know, she was bucking me on this building. She's bucking me ever since we started. So, you know, it's it's you know, I'm doing it whether she wants to or not. So, he wants to sink thousands of dollars whether it be cash or trade into this huge group that nobody's going to take care of and within a month or two we'll probably all be dead. I am Jade Barczyk. I am Brian and Lori's daughter. Um, we are watering ball pythons. This is not my favorite at all. I don't really like it at all, but when they need help, I get called to duty. Snakes and mice, it's just a way of life for me, so it's not a big deal. What? Where did I leave off? I'm so confused. Oh man, that hurts. I'm gonna have to go home probably. <laughs> Monday morning, it's the start of another week at BHB. Well, the problem is I come in every day and it's so hard to find a can. And I just have to go around and finally I get to the point where I'll just take whichever one I see because I need to get my work done. I don't have time to be searching around because nobody can put the cans back where they belong. So I'm the boss. I guess you gotta learn to deal with it. She can't find her can because she doesn't want to go to the back to get her can. She wants to get my can. And that's just fucking stupid. Unfortunately, that's the downside with working with a bunch of guys. Nobody knows how to put anything away. Well, that's probably true. Today is a big day. You know, we're here in Daytona Beach. This is the beginning of the show. Starts in about an hour here. So this is what we wait for all year. This is really what kicks off our show season. People enjoy our hard work. This is what we work for right here. People enjoy our hard work. This is what we work for right here. For the people to come to our shows, the people to see our animals, it's just, wow, you know, it's just mind boggling to them. It makes you feel good inside. Brian can't do anything small. Everything he does has to be huge, ginormous, out of the box, and just drive me out of my mind. It's me and Laura are button heads a little bit right now about raising snakes and how we're gonna get stuff, you know, as I'm, I'm trying to expand. So, you know, that's that's the biggest issue right now is just trying to get past that. You know, I wanna keep certain animals. She doesn't want me to because there's just too much uh, work for those guys. And okay. So that's you? So if you have any more work, just come see me. All right, I'll, I'll get you some more stuff. I'm gonna, by the way, I'm gonna probably do about 500 more. Get ready for about 500 more okay. corn snakes. That's coming. Okay, thanks. All right, no problem. All right. Kick you in the ass. Brian's nuts is what it is. He calls his guy, orders all this stuff. We might need some, but we certainly don't need 
however many hundreds uh, that 5, he ordered. So, yeah, 5,000. Now, what the hell is going on with this? He comes in, all I heard was blah, 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 blah. Here's 400 snakes. I don't know where the hell to put them. Keep them out of my room. Lock the door. Every time he comes in here, he brings a shitload of snakes and these little stupid blue cups. Yeah, now I gotta go set these up. I'm gonna feed. Oh, man. Henry. Hand dogs at it again. He's killing Buying you. shit we don't need. <laughs> Day in the life living with Ryan. <laughs>